How is it going everybody? Daniel here, you're watching Daniel Ball Tech. And today I'm gonna show you seven hidden features in iOS 5. Because everybody knows the new stuff like uh, notification center or notification in your not in your lock screen or newsstands, reminder, all of that stuff. Everybody knows that. But I'm gonna show you some things that you guys probably don't know. So first off, let me start with camera. So I'm gonna go here to camera. And uh, of course you guys know that you can simply go to the shortcut right here and it's gonna show your pictures. But uh, you can also swipe left and it's gonna show your pictures. So that's hidden feature number one. Okay, hidden feature number two is gonna be custom vibrations because in the, in the previous version of the uh, iOS you just had to choose the tone and the tone uh, had its vibration but now you can actually choose from three vibrations they have already there and you can actually create your own vibrations so uh, go to settings then you can go to general down there go to accessibility and down there again you're gonna see custom vibrations just switch it on go back go to sounds uh, and down there you're gonna see vibrations so vibrations so go here and you're gonna have a few uh, vibrations so as you guys can see you have alert heartbeat rapid SOS and symphony and you can create your own so to create you simply tap and the longer you tap the longer uh, it will respond. It's pretty intuitive. So first off, you tap. So anything you want, and then you play. And that's it. Then you can save. But I don't want to because this sucks. All right, so go back and that's hidden feature number two now let's go to the third go to calendar and that's pretty awesome so one new thing is that um, calendar works in landscape mode now so just flip it over and you're gonna get landscape mode with all your stuff which is pretty good and another thing is that you can simply hold and you can create a new event so hold it it will create a new event and as you can see right here it will show the time and then you just leave it and you have a new event and you can just fill it out and that works in portrait mode too so portrait hold it and there you go same thing next hidden feature is gonna be in phone you go here and the thing is that now you can delete uh, individual phone calls. So uh, this N11 was just a test. Uh, just I don't know if you guys I think I'm gonna I'm doing prank calls or stuff. So uh, and you can swipe and delete or delete or edit here and delete. So that's something pretty cool also. Okay, next feature is gonna be hourly weather. So you simply go to weather and you can see how's the weather gonna be hourly. So you swipe and you can see how's the weather is gonna be hour by hour. Or you can just tap and you're gonna see the same thing. Pretty cool. Next hidden feature is gonna be text shortcuts. I'm gonna show you how it works. You go let me go to messages and you simply you simply type uh, a shortcut and it will show you and it will make the full sentence so uh, OOMW already comes in iOS 5 so you put OMW space and it goes all my way so that's the one that comes but you can create more so go to settings I'm gonna go back settings general keyboard and down there you can see shortcuts as you guys can see all my way add a new shortcut and you can put like for example OMG, you guys know that. Oh my god. And go to messages. Oh, OMG. And as you guys can see, oh my god. And you can create whatever you want. 
Now let's go to the last hidden feature and that's going to be private browsing for you naughty boys that don't want your friends and family to see what websites are going. So you go to Safari and hit private browsing. And that and that's asking you to close all tabs. After you're closing Safari, it will automatically do that or not. So close all. And that's it. There's no need to test anything. So that's it guys. That's my seven hidden features for iOS 5. Uh, if you guys like this video and want to see more videos like that, just hit the subscribe button up there besides the red Dana Tech button. And when I post a new video, you guys are going to be notified on your YouTube homepage. And also please hit the like button down there. I really appreciate it. So that's it guys. Bye bye.